Uh, this is Patricia, your host, and you're watching Patricia Plays Life is Strange. Now, if you remember last time, those fucking bitches were in front of the dorm door, so I could not get into the hall, and I, I kept getting messed up on what I should do, on, and bro. I did not Come save on. because I was getting so frustrated, so we might go back yeah. to have to talk to them again. Yep. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Okay. Oh shit. There's Victoria and her mean girls. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, <laughs> the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. We ain't Hold that moving. pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Yeah, because if this is real life, I'd like take her by the arm and swing her around and fling her. Like, why do we have to go through all this shit? Shot. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. Yeah, let's. Just I just want to get Victoria at the thing. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria yeah. and her clones incentive to beat it. Where is the? No. Okay, now where exactly is the sprinkler valve? <laughs> valve. Okay, now where exactly is the sprinkler valve? Okay. Um. I don't know where a sprinkler valve would be. No, don't, don't, don't show the paint thing. That's not gonna work. I know it's not gonna work. I always try to run in this because we are so slow. And I always accidentally rewind the time. So let's try not to do nice, that. Bro. Oh. Hmm. Is that a sprinkler? That's a... I don't know what the fuck that even is. Nice, nice bra! Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. No, I don't want to rewind. Away. Oh, we got to rewind more. Hmm. I think it's a blood. You know, this doesn't work. Okay, let's see if this works. It doesn't. Sweet. Okay, so I can't actually run. It's R2. Oh, but R2 is also like to rewind faster. So it's very confusing. No. I wanted a slower paced game because awesome. I suck at Fortnite so much it makes my heart go boom 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 yeah. then the last of us my heart went boom 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 but I feel like this is way too slow we'll see 
kind of want to know. Close, story. but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. What the hell? Thanks so much for almost ruining my outfit. You're so lucky that I didn't fall on us. We'd see your ass so fast. Wonder. Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. What do we miss? What did we miss? What did we miss? I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. What did we I miss, just want to dude? get Victoria the hell out of the way. Okay, let's see if this works. I thought we decided it wouldn't. Then we're gonna do the sprinkler valve. Do I have to stand and watch oh, again? Dude. Are they actually th oh nice hmm. bro? <laughs> no. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. What the hell? We went to see Thanks so much ass. for almost ruining my outfit. And then, yeah, shut the fuck You're up. You're so lucky that I didn't I fall mean, on us. Shut the see peanut shell. So fast. Up. Think, Max. Rewind and find something. This didn't happen before. Find what? What are we supposed to find? Keep walking, hippie. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Hmm. A paint bucket next to Victoria. I see a plan. Do we not remember before we rewind? Because... Like the other, like times before, you remembered, but now it's like you don't remember. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at oh, the chill, so Victoria. First it's just water. You yeah, do water, water on my cashmere. And do you know how much this fucking you outfit do costs? You look the paint. great. I can't even chill on the steps. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, if I rewind, they'll go back to the steps. No. Nice bra. Nice throw. Hmm. to do the what? Oh. Uh. Tamper first. Okay, let's see if this works. Then. No. You have to time everything right. <laughs> My evil plan is working. Hey, Victoria? Oh, Sam, you're sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Awesome. Okay, so can I go in the dorm now? 
Uh, uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Confront! I am sorry. Why are you such That's a an bitch? awesome cashmere coat. Oh, yeah. No. Or that. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. I'm just a mean that girl was with me, a heart. But pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. No. I'll see you later. Au revoir. You were thinking it too. Victoria right? probably were... played me. I should have played. We don't care, Max. We just want in the dorm. Don't worry about Peta Victoria. Sorry, Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. our dorm. What's that? Oh, the missing person poster again. Hmm. Another one. Hoping for Jesus. Holy shit. Oh, Max's room. I don't have anything on mine. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Another pair of the same shoes you already have on. Home sweet home. Oh, my maybe. favorite cocoon. Oh, does she... she? Oh, no. I thought these were two beds, but I think this is like a couch. Yeah. Hmm. I would like to sleep. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. Oh, my when I swallowed your me. eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. Trauma bond. Okay, so we need to meet five more people. Where's my friend? It's He's not on here yet. Okay. What'd you say, Mom? Oh, it's the birthday. She's in college and she's only 18? Huh. Wow. What a dick. The principal said that... The, the the principal said this was a serious false charge and that he is worried you're telling stories. Call me ASAP so we can talk about this. Mom. What did I say to Kate? Any of these messages. It's a party and I cry if I want to. Cry if I want to. Cushion. Drawer. High five. Art books. I should hit the thrift store and pick up some dollar vinyl. Is that too hipster? Play something. I don't care. Music inspires me in my photography. Good song. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. 
I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. I heard that Dolly was a very rude man. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HD TV. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Dana. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. Oh, goodness. Cookies. I, I love that mom sent me a fat box really of chocolate good. coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. Oh, she sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Wow, I had like a moment there. Oh, that was a good song. I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbirds. Anyway, gotta get that flash drive. It's in Dana's room. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rotten there. Oh no. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Oh, Julia, this is so stupid. Answer, you wuss. Ah. Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh, yes, you Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. Uh, what did she do? What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my <gasps> boyfriend. Don't let me out. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Oh shit, I don't know. I don't know! Juliet Pats... Juliet Patson. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Watson. Okay, I'm gonna rewind time. We are gonna... Hey, Juliet. Is everything Watson. cool? Oh, yes, Max. Watson. I... Watson. 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 What did she do? What didn't she do? Oh, Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Be nice. Fuck Ouch. That. You How did you find out? my boyfriend? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking Everyone's me? Sending dick you never pics. talk. Just you zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? It's Watson. Juliet Watson. Duh. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. Do you so know what how introverts did you find are, out about Juliet them? Watson? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria, huh? She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. 
Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in I mean, her room. I bet Victoria did too. She's a fucking bitch. <clears throat> Can I uh go in, please? Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. Um Dana's still a cheerleader at heart. Oh my god. Can we just uh Hmm. Where am I supposed oh. to go? I can help Dana, and check out Victoria's room to find out if she is the kind of person I hope she's not. She is, Max. There's no boys allowed. Okay, Taylor is a slave. Red Rum. Um, wonder if it would say her name. She can't, like, be close because... Fire Alarm. Missing person. <gasps> Victoria's room's right across from mine. Oh, this is very scary. Anxiety of being in someone's room. And this game is just like the real thing. She has the missing persons. A book. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo and for this nice shot. Mm. Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Punked Juliet and Dana. Oh, I thought her name was Julia. See, I don't even know her first name. Asking me about her last name. So, how do you print it? So, how do you print it? How do I print it? How do I print it? I... Uh... Um, fast max. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Come on, let's go, let's go. Let's go, I'm... Juliet. Juliet, read this. Look at this fucking email, bitch. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. Mm -hmm. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And no. you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zack has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Oh, Warren's man, flash drive is on my desk. Is super low cut. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Okay, Dana. Hey, Dana. Where's Seriously, you? thanks again. Where's the I can't flash believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. Ugh. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though too. Warren obviously likes hanging with you. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. okay. I gotcha. Are you blushing? <laughs> Go ahead and grab the flash drive whenever. I'll do it now. 
Whoa, pregnancy test. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Do that? Oh, I want to see the, the folder. Can I put the flash drive in my laptop? I better make sure everything is still in there. Weird I science. think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. Warm be in here. Spot. He, he. Fuck this shit. Ow. Oh my god. Hurt. Damn. I better rewind. Ouch. Poor Alyssa. That'll leave a bruise. Do we want to rewind? Just kidding. How mean. Fuck this shit. Ow. That hurt. <laughs> well, like. Should we talk to Alyssa or Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually oh, helped. That didn't somebody. face you at all. Uh, if we're not friends, why do you have my fucking number? So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. I could rewind and try something different. Do I still have the picture? Okay. Why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. 
I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Oh, I feel like we're rewinding too much. Curse. I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. On the truck. Max, get your ass over here. Um, I what am. up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. No problem. He wanted to hug you. Check bitch. out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. Mm. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong town. Just one. 60 but miles? Then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I I'll bet. Say. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Um, movie booty? Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from Akira to Twilight Zone, which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than thief. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Yeah, I saw that. Uh, no fucking way will that, I watch that. that my mind is twisted enough. <laughs> I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Faster pussycat kill kill. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white, plus babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. Yeah, I need to talk. I need to talk to somebody, just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me Sorry, everything. I'm pretty tired. You For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, this go on. To take I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, yeah. life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max mm -hmm. Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal now. Uh, are you Answer me, bitch. Me? I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. <laughs> they try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do oh, not analyze me! Crazy. I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. <sighs> Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! Oh. Hey! Leave him he alone! Is crazy. Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore leave in the bathroom! <gasps> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Go! Go! I got this! Get in, Max! Get your punk asses out of there now! 
Don't even try to run! Nobody! Yes. Nobody! Man, <laughs> Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. Isn't she the girlfriend Feels the so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? No, it felt like a real city for artists. Big and bright. Great for taking pictures. Yeah. Must be hard coming back to a hick town like Arcadia again. Not after seeing you. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course. It's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Damn. I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliché geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. in don't be shy the house still looks nice home shit home maybe I can end it here My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Oh my gosh. Put on some music while I medicate. Okay. Thank you for watching this little interesting game that I've decided to play. Until next time. Peace out, Girl Scouts.